I'm so funny because like I've never seen him move so fast in life. I literally jumped out of bed. It's right. Keep riding. Guys, this is the magpie. This is the one that keeps whipping the kids. That gets hectic. Are you like running after them? Come on, guys, just keep running. Go slow. I like nice birds. Like so it hit her in the head like twice and then she fell off her bike. Last time I'm crying for you. I already got over this last time. She's gone. She's gone. I'm done. <laughs> Bit of devastation with the pool situation, Cody. It's not. Thank you, Udi, for sponsoring today's video. The Udi is a fantastic item to wear when lounging around. When you're working from home or you just want to chill out on the couch. It's so soft and warm, so easy to wash, and comes in so many different colors and designs. So when do you love wearing your Udi, Kurt? Um, after a shower, when the kids are all ready for bed, sitting down watching the television, it's good. Snuggle up to them. Yeah, a little snuggle fish. I love wearing my Udi when I'm cooking dinner. It's been so freezing cold lately, and I feel the cold, don't I? This is perfect for me. It's honestly like a walking blanket. Oh, and I've been wearing mine when I go check on, I check on the kids every night. So I've just been whacking it on, quickly run down, check them, come back up. Miller calls it her fluffy marshmallow outfit and Linky calls it his sumo wrestling outfit. <laughs> the kids love it. If you guys want to check out Udi, I do have $30 off any Udi store wide. All you need to put in is Aussie 30 at checkout. Thanks again, Udi, for sponsoring today's video. Good morning, guys. Kurt and I are just talking about my tummy issues and I feel like I haven't really spoken too much. I've mentioned it here and there, like people always ask me, why do you not eat white bread? Why do you not eat like this? Why do you not eat that? And I feel like I've kind of like touched on it a little bit in pieces, um, but I don't think everyone would understand how ill I actually get when I eat it. It's getting to the annoying point, isn't it? I'll literally have like such bad diarrhea all day or I will Ew. throw up. Girls well, it's the truth. Poop. It's the Girls truth. Don't poop. Or I will throw up and I have like stabbing pains in my stomach. As you guys know, I've been eating really, really clean. My eating thing that I wanted to do was three weeks. It was up. I said I wanted to do it for three weeks. Went out for dinner and I treated myself. I got a meal at the pub and yesterday I paid for it like most of the day. I was just so sick. I feel like I don't know whether I have allergies to things or whether I have IBS. I obviously don't want to diagnose myself. I need to go see probably someone. It's what Kurt's saying to me. It's such an often occurrence. Yeah. Even if it's not. Yesterday was bad. But yep. like other days are like, oh, my stomach. And then for three hours you complain about your guts. Yeah, I know. No, you shouldn't have to complain. Like it should. You know what I mean? Like it's the obviously... last like three times I've had pizza, I've thrown up. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so well, you're, yeah. Not, you're not allergic to me. Lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I wish I was. <laughs> I feel like as I'm getting oh, older, it's getting worse. You used to just feel So I get funny from definitely gluten. I get funny from full cream, like full cream milk, full cream cream. You'd have chicken, lettuce, and water and just keep it as that. Pretty much it. So I said to Kurt, well, I've been on my health kick. I felt so good. I haven't been sick once. I haven't complained about a sick stomach the whole three weeks. Not once. No, not once. Not mm. once, which I felt great, and I wanted to continue to do that wherever I could, but at the same time, I'm all about, you know, still, when you're out and about with friends, that it's nice to be able to still enjoy yourself and have a treat, but... Yeah, have chips and dips and breads. And yeah, I just don't know if my body's going to let me. It's, like, literally just not even worth it. For, no. like, for ages, I was like, oh, I felt a bit queasy, so I will just eat, like, a bit of bread and I'll feel a bit sick later. But now it's like I eat it and I'm, like, I'm very not... ill. I'm vomiting or, like... I'll be Happens so often. Yeah. Happens too often. Too often. Yeah, and it's always when I eat different foods or when I eat takeaway. Hey, your oh my gosh, you want to tell what happened? <laughs> Middle of the night. Last night, the cat always comes up, has a little sleep with me, which is, oh, he's up here now too. Yeah, he comes to he, sleep with me as well. No, he doesn't. He, he loves, does. I saved his life. He whiz, he's always with <laughs> he me. He still loves me. Yeah, and then he went over to Kiara's side. For the one time. He wanted to play. He goes under the blanket when he wants to play. 
and then he just bit her ass. <laughs> he bit me like straight oh, on the it was bum. So funny. It was so funny because like I've never seen him move so <laughs> fast in life. I literally jumped out of bed. It was so funny. Anyways, we better get up. We better get. I'm gonna stay in bed. I'll have a coffee. Are you gonna make me coffee? I'll have a full cream little coffee, please. <laughs> I'll put full cream in it. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> not stop eating does she she just wants to eat all day long and you just eat everything hello guys we are heading out to go to my mum and dad's house this morning if you guys watched the last vlog you will know my sister is moving to Western Australia but with um, Queensland having their lockdowns at the moment she's actually not able to get across the border even to fly um, so she's had to keep rescheduling her flight so she was supposed to be gone over a week ago now so today she's kind of waiting and seeing what's happening but she's supposed to be going on a flight this afternoon anyways we're gonna go see her again today just in case it is the last time Maybe we get a time. chance to see her we'll end up doing another nine times. <laughs> I know I hope not just, oh, I hope it just all settles down for everyone no, they're all right. They're all right. It's all right. Mommy and Daddy here. Mom, I can't go. It's okay, little magpie. He's just eating some worms. I'm like eyeing it off after me getting attacked. I'm so scared. I don't trust you. <laughs> That's where the way they get scared because of you. I know. I know. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's birds everywhere. They just flick nearly hit my head. You can go, guys. Okay, we go all the way out there. Go, go, go! 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 Baby Who are you gonna give it to? Um, Portie. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, do you like your new bike? Yeah, I like my big bike. Big boy bike. You can, can you can go super fast. I'll go and catch him Dad. Don't crash into him. <laughs> Can I don't crash into that car. No. That would be a bit crazy. How I crash into the glass? I'm not trying to crack all of it. It's rocks. What is it? Oh, is there rubbish on the floor? Yeah. It's a bit naughty, hey? Yeah, someone sucked in the road there. It's a bit naughty? Yeah. What do you say to them? We suck it in, in the bin. That's right. Yeah, but we always do that. We do always do that, hey, because it's the right thing to do. Yeah, but not for the floor. Yeah. No. no. Oh, oh, everyone will see the nail tip on the flying shoes. Oh, my goodness. It'll be just yucky, hey? Yeah, and I think. Yeah. Are you gonna get a coffee or no? Yeah. Alright. Oh, you take like full. 
before you go. I went like. Yeah, it's good. I just tried a new toothpaste. It's so good. I'm testing out a new toothpaste, guys. I've only tried it once. It's like a whitening one. So see how it goes over the next few weeks. So, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna see. Like you know, what I mean, you can't tell how good something is from using it once. Give it a go for a few weeks and see how I have it. Kurt keeps commenting on my teeth. He's like, they look so white. I need all the whitening toothpaste I can get between my red wine and my coffee. <laughs> Apparently the most way to wipe your teeth is kissing, kissing, kissing. Oh really? Yeah. Okay. I, I just wrote about it. Oh okay. It's alright. Keep riding. Guys, this is the magpie. This is the one that keeps whipping the kids. That gets hectic. Are you like running after them? Come on guys, just keep riding. I don't Go slow. I like nice birds. Yeah, I did not trust this after the other day. The other day guys, that exact bird, we're going to my mum and dad's house. I was shaking so bad. I was with Miller and it knocked her off her bike. So it hit her in the head like twice and then she fell off her bike. Thank God she had a helmet on because it hit her helmet. But she was like bawling. She hurt her toe and got it stuck underneath the bike. It was like, and then it kept coming back and I was like screaming, I hate magpies. Yeah, and there's just like two um, around us that are really angry every year. Like every single year there's signs up and everything being like beware magpie swooping because there's two in particular that just literally attack people. So that was the magpie, that was the evil one. And I think the best thing we did was just go nice and slow. I think if you, like when the kids are riding their bikes really fast, that's when they tend to get attacked because obviously they think that the kids are a danger to their little baby birdies. But man, I was shaking just then. Hello. Hello. Where are you going? Keep PJs. <laughs> I'm hungover. Oh, no. How are you feeling? Good. Hey, are you gonna open that for me, little man? Are you locking me out? Yeah, yeah. Oh, muscles, muscles. Morning. Oh, how are you, sweetie? So I didn't actually realize, but Sienna's booked this flight from New South Wales. So she is 110% going today and today is her last day because she doesn't have to cross the border. So this is it. This is the last time I'm gonna see my sister for I don't know how long between COVID and everything else. I know it's gonna be hard for them to get back. Um, and she's gonna be over there for probably the next five years. Oh really? Well you better lay down. Oh, is he? <laughs> FaceTime on your Monday anyway. <laughs> yeah. Love you. Love you so much. We are home. We we're gonna cook brekkie. We've just had half a banana each. And we we're like, instead of doing brekkie, let's do a quick workout first. Gonna get a quick workout in and then make some food.
Here is breakfast, guys. Yum, yum, yum. Bit of devastation with the pool situation, Cody. It's not... It's not good. It's not like me. No. No. Let us know what's happened to your pool. Chemicals last week. Yeah. So it should be perfect, but she ain't. No. She's not perfect, so the filter needs clean out. I just had a look, it's cooked. Yeah, okay. So, she'll be right. We'll get through this. <laughs> <Little> smiling. <laughs> and then you do it should smile. only take a half an hour. Really. Yeah. Like, oh, it's so, you can't just look at it. Looks like I've got the green lights on. <laughs> you give me the biggest chicken wing. Yes, you are. Cute. Mommy's ready for a hold for you. Yeah. So, as you guys know, we normally have got like a really nice blue looking pool. The pool is literally green. Kurt and I are like, what is going on? Yesterday, Kurt's like, maybe it's because there was ashes falling from the sky, which we kept like on top of, trying to be on top of. Um, and then he's like, maybe it's this, maybe it's that. When I checked the filter and it needs a good clean out. So, I'll show you guys what the pool's looking like. It is not blue anymore. Yeah, it's not blue. It is green. Not Very good. Sad. Especially in winter. That never normally happens in winter. Well, this is good. And then someone will be coming, so I won't have to worry about it. Yeah. The weather has gone so cold, guys. It's so windy outside and there's like a big rain cloud coming over. It's meant to rain like the Savo and tomorrow. Let's go see what the kids are up to. I'm here them laughing. Has he got no pants on? We kids did a poo, so I liked his bum. No, did you? Yeah. Miller. And I washed my hair. <laughs> These kids have done so many poos today, I can't even keep count. Did you actually do a poo? Yeah. And Mila just said that she washed his bum. Yeah. You're a mini mum, aren't you? I'm not a mini mum. You're a mini mama. You're a mini mum. You're a mini mama. And then I'm Riley calls Boko mini Boko. <laughs> yeah, she calls Linky mini Boko. Ah! Ready, ready? Linky, don't stand on me. Don't stand on me. Please. <laughs> <laughs> he just fell off me. <laughs> what are you doing? I'll show you. It's devastation. It's turned, you know, it's usually blue. Yeah. It's turned green. <laughs> yep, it's a green pool. Look how dirty this lens is. Oh my gosh. Yep, do you know why it's green? Because it's dirty. I think that's the greenest I've ever seen it in my whole life. I've never seen it so bad. Come here, my girl. Goodbye. You come with mummy. Oh, you come with mummy. Yes, you can. I love you. Have you guys watered your flower pot lately? No. Have you been doing it? I don't know why he, we haven't been doing it because we keep forgetting. Yeah, mummy has a problem with that and plants too. Mummy can't even my, keep a cactus alive. My dad's so gonna remember and daddy just waters the whole thing. Yeah. Ready? Steady. <laughs> I won! Oh, you look so relaxed oh under God. the tree. Oh, it has a football thing. Is that relaxing? This one does the Look how dirty it is. That's why it's not working. That's supposed to be white. <laughs> oh. Oh my god, look at that. It's looking good. It's looking like new again. Well guys, we're gonna finish up cleaning this filter and then get the kitties down for a nap. Little Miss Regie and Mr. Linky. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you guys. <laughs> we'll see you guys soon.